Hello everybody and welcome to Let's Look at Quarrel. This is a new game that just came out for Xbox Live Arcade, but I believe it's based on an iOS game. It seems like a lot of these games coming to Xbox Live Arcade and Steam these days are based on iOS games. But in any case, this is a word game that kind of combines Risk and, you know, that uh, maybe Boggle you could say, or Scrabble. Anyway, you'll see. I'm, full disclosure, going into this mostly sight unseen, and I'm also only playing the trial here. But based on the little bit of time that I spent with the trial, this definitely seems like a game that I might pick up the full version of. Because I am a sucker for word games, and also, it is only 400 points, which is actually kind of a rarity these days on the Xbox Live Arcade. So I will be starting first here. As you can see, the land is kind of divided in a similar to risk kind of way. And I will start with the first turn here. So the first thing that I can do is choose to either attack, reinforce, or move my troops. What I'm going to do is try to attack this yellow area here so that I can kind of join the areas that I'm in. Uh, that, I'm, that I currently occupy. Now you'll see in this, it's best word wins. I don't know if there's a time limit, but I am essentially going to look at this and see if I can figure out a better word than the opponent. And if I win, I believe I knock out some of their troops. Now let's see what we have here. You can always reshuffle your letters. I could easily make a word like traps. Can I, I only have five letters with which to do it. Oh, I do only have... Okay, so every troop gives you another letter that you can make. Traps is not a big word, but it would be kind of harder to get better. Um, unless I made, like, trolls. No, that wouldn't even work. I think this is the best word I can make. Let's submit it. Alright. So I've got traps, and they've got sap. Sucks for you. Now I'm doing this uh, Let's Look At Live, which is maybe against my better judgment because I'm kind of thinking that maybe I'm going to look like an idiot here when I do some of these words. Uh, but hopefully it doesn't work out like that. I'm a big fan of games like Boggle and, you know, Anagram, stuff like that. So hopefully I can, I can kind of demonstrate that I'm not an idiot. But I am pretty bad at risk, which creates a problem. You know what, let's try to beat uh, this blue area here too, and then I'll try to reinforce troops over to uh, that one spot there that has the match on it. I don't know what the match means, but that means maybe I can't attack, or maybe I can't do anything with that spot. But anyway, we'll just go for broke here. This will be me versus Dwayne. What I really don't want to see is the computer play against itself. Alright, what can I make here? I can make kite. I can make knit. What's better, kite or knit? It looks like the same. I could make, hmm, Riker. <laughs> Nike, Tyke, Kiter. Well, I can only with only four letters. I think the best word for me here is kite. I believe so. Anyway, let's try it. Uh, submit word. He's gonna have a hard time beating me here. Three points. Yeah, I pretty much destroyed him. The anagram there was Tinkerer, so every time you get a, a seven-letter word like that, they will allow you... Sorry, eight-letter word like that. They will allow you, uh, after you finish, the service of telling you what you should have put in. Obviously, I couldn't put that in, though, because uh, I didn't have... What am I trying to say here? I didn't have enough, uh, didn't have enough people. So I want to reinforce here. Oh, you can only move over one spot, which means I'm an idiot and I'm probably going to lose uh, all of those spaces right there. But I'm going to stop my turn right here. And we'll see what... Oh, they reinforce at the end of the turn. Thank God. At the end of the turn. Oh, God. Okay, we'll see what the AI does here. So we'll go over to Dwayne. And Dwayne is going to fight me. All right. Big mistake, Dwayne. We both get five letters here. Best word wins. Okay. Crude seems to be a good one here. So I'm going to go with that. And we'll, oh, that's the wrong button. We'll submit crude. Hopefully that'll work. I don't see how you could do much better than that. Nerd, seven points. Crude, 11 points. Sorry about that. Very good defense. That means I must... Do I kill everyone? I had to kill some people at least. Four of them. Wow, that's really bad for him. I guess it's based on the amount of points that you beat them by. So I'll be able to take over that area very quickly. Like I said, I'm a sucker for these like word games. So he's ended his turn. So I think I definitely will pick this up. Uh, just to play it online, I'm sure there's going to be frustrating things online. I hope that there's a time limit on the amount of uh, the amount of time that you can take before you uh, have to play a word. Dwayne and Caprice are going to go at it here. Okay, so I can make a word before the quarrel is over. That's all I have to do. Okay, let's let's make lanes. There you go. 
I got six points. It's probably not going to beat them. I probably should have found a way to get that Y in there. Oh. Ah, they did beat me. Oh, well. The anagram was insanely... Ah, I should have... Lanes and I didn't even think about doing insane? That was stupid. Oh, well. She will probably end her turn pretty quickly. Yep. But now... I will be able to hopefully take over some people here. Definitely I'll be able to take over... Oh, I can't do that. Uh, I'll be able to take over one of Dwayne's last remaining territories here. So me versus Dwayne. Dude only has two letters, so he's in a pretty difficult spot. Uh, I am gonna... Oh, I wish I had six letters. I can make grain, but I could have made grainy. But I could make... Rainy, which is a little bit better than Grain, I think. Yeah, I get an, an extra point in there. Hmm, yeah, this seems alright. I don't think he has a chance, let's put it that way. The anagrams were Organity and Gyration. I wasn't even close to getting those, but hey, I still got some fairly decent, uh, decent words there. And now, Dwayne is dead in that corner. Where can I go from here? I could try to take out Caprice or Dwayne at those 6 and 5 slots, but that doesn't seem like a good idea to me right now, so I'm going to reinforce here. No, no, don't, don't. Confirm transfer. How many people do I want? I want all of them. Send all the people there. Confirm transfer. And I might as well send these guys over here. Yeah, confirm, tra select, yes, to, to here. There we go. Confirm transfer. Can I send these guys over here then? Yeah, we'll send them over there. Okay. And then... Oh, I can't send those guys over though. Oh well. Well, we might as well send these guys over here though. Yep. And how many? As many as I can. Alright. Confirm transfer. I can do no more. End turn. Okay. Well, I've got pretty good fortifications going on though, which is fine by me. I feel like I'm probably going to win this one. <laughs> Just the way that the map is looking right now. I own most, more territory than both of them combined. Alright, Dwayne's gonna take a go at Caprice here. Alright, make a word before the quarrel's over. Olivia! Olivian? Would that work? I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with that, I'm fine. Invalid! That's not true! Ah, uh, I didn't get a chance. I was just thinking of Olivia Wilde. Oval's a pretty good word. No is not a very good word. Pavilion, of course. Alright. Dwayne's gonna take over Caprice. Caprice is nearly dead. Dwayne is spreading himself pretty thin. I really like the way it gives you definitions of the word after you finish. So you can see pavilion down there. It also just gave us a definition for no. <laughs> which is probably not necessary. Alright, Caprice. What are you gonna do? You're gonna probably attack Dwayne. I think that's a good idea. And now, well, these guys just blow themselves up. Oh, I'm going to try to make a word here. Hmm. Toned is the best I can do. As quickly as I can. Anyway. Acne for five. Oat for three. <laughs> Looks like I win. Apparently. Does that give me bonus points or something? Or bonus troops? Now, I should be able to take over both of these guys next turn. Oh, especially if they're going to do that. This could be the killer blow for Dwayne. I don't know what I'm getting, what these bonuses give me. Oh, man, that's a good word. Finite. I'm going to submit that one for sure. What would be the... Hmm, fit. That's not good enough. File is also not good enough. Filoting. The filleting. A filoting. I feel like I've been doing pretty good with my word IQ so far in this video, but saying piloting probably makes me sound like an idiot. Well, uh, these guys are going to be easily wiped out. At least Caprice is. 7 versus 2 and 8 versus 2. Good luck. Right, so let's do 8 versus 2 first. As long as I make like a three letter word, there should be basically no chance for her. Hmm. I don't like these letters. But if we do... Sing... Nosing? Like nosing your way into something? I can't do that. Cozing? Um, let's get rid of these letters. Honestly, 
grins is probably the best I can do here. The best I can do, not the best that can be done. Crossing, scorings, and scoresing. Alright, well obviously I won that one. With a crushing victory, no less. Remember, this is just me playing against the AI right now. The AI seems pretty easy, but the way they seem to insinuate it is the more you play the game, the higher your quote-unquote word IQ goes, and the harder AI you actually come across, which is kind of cool. Um, let's go 7 versus 2 here. Let's call backup? Alright, call backup. I've got some backup in here. I don't think that was necessarily necessary. So we got another ing here. Let's rearrange our letters. I don't like the way they look right now. Smug is alright. Rugs. Mugs. Grins. <laughs> do grins again. Or grim. Grim's okay. I'll take grim. I think this is gonna be fine. Versus two letters. The anagram was smurring. Well, they got is, which is not quite smurring. So I will succeed there. Thank you for the definition of is down there on the bottom. Now I should be able to maybe end the game here. Potentially. Seven versus five. I do have extra backup apparently, which is probably not necessary again. Alright, me and Dwayne. Let's do this, Dwayne. Might as well give it a try. Uh, I guess I will call backup or she called backup. Now. This is an interesting one. Let's rearrange the letters again. He's got six, I've got eight. We've got swam, slim, limbs. Oh man, he made a six letter word. That's not good for me. Beams, hmm, males, bales. You know what? I think bales or beams. Beams is a little bit better than bales. Let's try beams. Could work. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna go with. Beams, 12 points. Seal, 5. Oh, he tricked me. He didn't have enough. Alright, well, that'll be the win for me then. The anagram was web nails. I never would have gotten that. <laughs> but anyway, it looks like I succeeded here, so let's let the game finish and see what happens. Looks like it maybe has like an RPG component. I, I shouldn't say that without actually knowing. Let's see. Oh yeah, populate the map with my spawn, and that really phallic fountain just went off. Alright, so it does look like that the higher you go, the more levels you beat, the more difficult you come across. Average word score is 9 points, that's not bad. Best word score was beams, actually. Word IQ is competent. Wow, that's, that's kind of offensive. Uh, let's continue. Play again, um, I don't want to restart the match, no, that's fine. Farewell to you, Quarrel. Uh, so, like I said, we do have multiplayer here as well, so we can play against real people from around the world. I have no idea how the multiplayer works. But what I will say is that Quarrel is probably a game that I'm going to pick up. And if you watched this all the way through and you found it appealing to yourself, this is probably a game that you're going to enjoy as well. I mean, if you're a fan of Scrabble, if you're a fan of, fan of Boggle or Balderdash or all other such games, then you're probably going to be a fan of Quarrel. I'm not sure how the online is going to work, but even single player is kind of fun. It's just like a casual time waster anyway. Also, worth noting that, as I mentioned, this is only 400 Microsoft points, so around 5 US dollars. So this is definitely, uh, you know, a fair price to play. Fair price to pay if this is a game that you feel that you would be interested in. By and large, I have pretty, pretty positive impressions of Quarrel so far, and definitely do not feel that this is a disgrace for the Xbox Live Arcade, which is kind of crazy considering the games that we've had the past few weeks. As always, thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Don't forget that the word of the day is SCAG.